I spend as much time talking to patients about their unhealthy lifestyle and dietary habits as much as the cancer. I don't have enough time to talk about the cancer because half the time we're talking about how incredibly unhealthy we live. We live in a society, and I'm sorry this sounds so militant, but <laughs> you, you can feel my frustration. We live in a culture that breeds cancer. We, we, we have an incredibly calorie dense, high animal fat, lazy uh, environment that we live in, which is completely different than anything humanity has ever really known. And then add to that the anxiety. You know, there, there's a woman who goes around who's talk, who talks about, you know, how we can treat our children better. But, and to use her words, we live in the fattest, most anxiety ridden, more heart diseased, most drug addicted, uh, you know, and, and culture than ever, than humanity has ever known. And we can't make the cancer go away. And unfortunately for most of you, those types of interventions are not going to make things turn around, but they may set you up to be healthier and stronger to handle whatever stresses the cancer and us may throw at you.